in this video I want to pay some attention to this uh, audio mixer. You see how it was made. This is a part of the circuit. The knobs from volume, the end volume, are falling off because of this demo. And I want to refer first to my book Schematics to Audio Amplifiers and Loudspeaker Boxes. Radio M232. You can find it on the internet with this international standard book number, but also on the Lulu website. When you buy it on the Lulu website, it's the cheapest way to buy it. This book uh, handles about audio circuits, but uh, the main issue is uh, good practice and pitfalls. Also uh, a chapter about loudspeaker boxes, but um, more important is that this book is not a real hi-fi book. And then I mean, I don't care about uh, distortion uh, figures from 0.001% or so, but I care, I want to care about a good sound. A proper sound, a sound that you like, a sound that you can adapt to your own ideas. Because, in my opinion, uh, how loudspeaker boxes sounds, sound um, is individual, is relative. Uh, and sometimes it doesn't matter whether there is distortion in your audio sound. For instance, tube amplifiers have um, quite a high internal distortion. Of course, not all of them, but okay. You see some schematics. But let's go back here to this preamplifier. Why it was made that way and how it was made. Um, three knobs are, four knobs are here. They uh, uh, regulate the volume from all the channels here all the input channels and on the, in the middle of the screen you can see now uh, the microphone channels. The aim from the circuit was to make the uh, hum level as low as possible. And it was completely built with salvaged uh, components. All the components were old and salvaged. So how to do that? That's the aim of this uh, video. Well, let me give you some tips. Uh, here I slide out the circuit from the box. Now here's the box. That's the first tip. Make the circuit uh, a preamplifier circuit at first in a proper way and then after all when it completely works it is completely free of hum slide it into a good well looking or not well looking wooden or um, plastic box. So the chassis here has to be made in such a way that the whole preamp is uh, free of hum. And there are quite a few tricks uh, to tell. At first, all the metal parts here have to be connected. So here you see for instance a grey wire that's connected here to the metal here. 
Um, also here, there is part of metal that's connected to the chassis. But the input uh, plugs, input sockets, are not directly connected to the chassis. They are all isolated and all these input sockets are going to one central point, one grounded earth point somewhere in the circuit and that is often uh, the minus from the power supply capacitor. And that is, as far as I can see, somewhere here, this is the transformer, the AC transformer. And there is a bridge rectifier here inside. Uh, I want to show it better, but in that case I have to um, take the whole circuit apart. But uh, there is a bridge rectifier and then there is a, a stabilizing unit here. And a lot of capacitors around it to um, uh, keep the circuit completely free of hum. And on my YouTube channel you can find uh, quite a few uh, videos about how to uh, make a completely hum free power supply. You can also see here that the transformer is mounted in a certain way. I found it I found it out found out that this way of mounting had the effect that the lowest uh, uh, stray capacitance entered the very sensitive uh, audio amplifier input. Every transformer has a stray field around it and this stray field must not get into the very sensitive input uh, inputs from the audio amplifier, the pre-amplifier in this case. I only have one minute and nine seconds left on my card so I want to keep it short. Um, proper positioning of the transformer, good shielding, uh, all earth connections connected properly, all mass connections connected properly, there's only one uh, earth ground connection that's somewhere here in the circuit. Uh, the whole circuit must be free of hum and then slide it into uh, a wooden or plastic cabinet and uh, that are the most important things to tell.